In case you missed it, the Cardinals open up their season today on the road in Cincinnati. And if you're going to watch the game, take note. They will be broadcast on Bally Sports Midwest, which is formerly Fox Sports Midwest as of today. We welcome Cardinals broadcaster and former Cardinals pitcher Brad Thompson with us to talk about the season and all the changes on and off the field. How you doing, Brad? Randy, I'm doing great. How are you doing today? Fantastic. Thank you. Got our Cardinal Red on. All right. Now, first of all, talk about the switch of the network. A lot of people may not know this, but Fox Sports Midwest has gone away. It's now Bally Sports Midwest. What's going to change for you guys in the booth? Yeah, well, the beauty of it is uh, for Cardinal fans that we're going to be watching is that uh, there's going to be changes, but a lot of things are going to be the same, right? Your channel is still the same. If you have the Fox Sports app, it's now just the Bally's app. So if you were able to watch before, you're able to watch now. As far as your viewing and, and how that changes, there's going to be new graphics. There's going to be new music. There's going to be new logos. I mean, the, the sets are going to be totally different. But overall, the, the uh, goal is still the same, Randy. It's, it's bringing Cardinal baseball to the people. It's bringing Blues hockey to the people. And that's what Bally Sports is going to be all about. And, and regarding the Cardinals, as for the team, got to talk about Wainwright Molina Battery. Even as a former pitcher, you are you surprised that they're still able to do what they do? Yeah, I know how I feel when I wake up in the morning, and I'm the same age as these guys. And <laughs> I yap on the radio and talk on TV. I, I'm so excited to see them out. And, and I... I believe, like all the other Cardinal fans, believe that they were going to be back. But Yachty's in his 18th season. Adam Wainwright in his 16th season. And the beauty of it is, Randy, as you know, they're not slowing down. Waino was the ace of this staff last year. Yachty is the heart and soul of what they do. So to see this group back together and to see them back with fans in the stands, yeah. that's the beauty of it. Because there were milestones hit last year that we didn't get to enjoy as a fan base. So I'm excited about that. Yeah, we're, we're, we're lucky about that. They're only going to have limited capacity at Bush Stadium next week. And uh, the fans, even though the, the crowd will be smaller, you can bet the ovation for Arenado when he steps on the field going to be crazy. Well, you heard it in spring training. His first at bat in spring training, there were, uh, you know, a, a thousand people or so, and the people went nuts uh, seeing Nolan Arenado, and rightfully so. This is a missing link that the club needed badly. Since Nolan Arenado came into the league, nobody has driven in more runs than him in baseball. I mean, the guy has been uh, fantastic, and he is just a fit. He loves baseball. He's a grinder. He's going to be perfect. And yes, the fans are going to go nuts. And fortunately, this isn't a one-year thing. We're going to get to see Nolan yeah. Arenado for a long time. Speaking of someone who's likely going to be around for a while, the youngster, Jack Flaherty. He's a really young guy, but man, is he fire on the mound. Going to be cold in Cincinnati today, only a high of 39 degrees. What can we look for him in the cold today? Hey, you know what? The cold actually might work to the pitcher's benefit when you look at a game like this because once you get warmed up, those batters are still cold. You can get in on the hands a little bit. Jack Flaherty uh, had, uh, you look at the numbers overall last year, and, and they don't look great, right? Had an ERA approaching five. Jack had one bad game. He had one bad game where he gave up nine. This kid is determined to go out there and be the ace of the staff, to be the rock. He's got lights out stuff. It's I know it's an honor for him to get this second opening day start. And what I look for for Jack this year is to be a dominant presence from start one all the way through the end of the year because that's the kind of stuff Jack has. All right, baseball is back, and we're going to look forward to seeing you on Bally Sports Midwest. we got to get used to saying that for all the Cardinals games and Blues games, right? <laughs> oh, absolutely. I'm still getting used to it as well, but it's going to be fun. I think the fans are going to love it, and I can't wait. It's an honor to be on the call today. I'm pumped up to be alongside Dan McLaughlin. Fantastic. We'll see you throughout the season, Brad. Thanks for joining us this morning. And for Cardinals fans who want to check out the Cardinals schedule, we'll have a link to it on our website as well as our Fox 2 mobile app.